In this video, we will study about another important concept, earthing of concentric shells. We have already studied earthing of metal sphere. Now, what will happen if we have shells? So, let us say we have a we have two concentric shells. same center so it is concentric and let the radius of the inner sphere be a center point c and the radius of the outer sphere let it be b let let us consider that we connect the inner sphere with earth okay the inner sphere is connected to the earth and a positive q charge is given on the outer sphere outer shell now what will happen if as soon as this inner inner shell is connected to the earth the potential on the inner shell will be equal to zero because of the flow of the charge qe so this qe will be deposited on the inner shell so as to make the potential equal to zero now how do we find this value of qe now in the inner shell the potential will be due to its own charge which is qe and the potential due to the outer shell which is which has charge plus q so that the final potential of the inner shell should be equal to zero now the potential due to its own charge will be equal to kqe and its own radius which is a plus potential due to the outer surface now for this shell outer shell this point or any point on the inner shell is an inside point now we have already studied that in a metal surface a charge is distributed then the every point inside that surface behaves like an equipotential point that means whatever is the potential on this point at every point inside this shell the potential will be same so how much is the potential at this point it is k into q upon its radius b so this is the potential due to its own charge of inner shell and this is the potential due to the outer shells so always remember when we are when one body is inside the another metallic body then all the points inside the metallic body will have the same potential as on the surface of outer body okay so now this should be equal to zero because it is earth and we calculate this then we'll find out that qe will be equal to minus qa upon b so this is how you can find out charge required to make the potential of the inner shell zero in this particular case of concentric shells.